Hello there, everybody. Arctic Platypus here. I haven't been on the YouTube channel in a long time. I was on vacation for three weeks, and I had band camp for a week. I've just been doing so much stuff. Oh, seven days to die, guys. I'm back. Back talking about seven days to die. Another update. Wow. Alpha 9, guys. Alpha 9. It's been a year since Alpha 1 came out. I, uh, I started playing this game in Alpha 5, and you see, uh, I have like 57 hours on the game in total. Just played the played it a ton. It's been a, it's I love this game, but the thing I got bored of it, and I, I have those 57 hours were I were they were I played those before like four months ago. So I played those in the first like two or three months that I got the game. Then I just kind of stopped playing because. It's just uh, the same map over and over again. Kind of got old, I think, is one thing. And there's, I I don't know, it got boring. It did get boring after I played that long. Because, I don't know, it just kept, it's felt the same. When they added Smooth Terrain, I played an additional amount of time. I played a ton when, when in Alpha 7. Alpha 8, I, have, I did not play Alpha 8 whatsoever. Uh, I don't know why. I just didn't get around to it. But now Alpha 9, guys. Random world generation. Whew. It's insane. It's insane. It generates just everything. It generates everything you would find in the original map that they had. Cities, roads, mountains, cliffs, lakes, whatever. Rivers. All the biomes. Even there's actually new... I think there's a few new biomes, maybe. Actually, never mind. There's not. But... Um, all the biomes, they're actually bigger, random, there's just everything, nice hills, the smooth terrain looks even better now because it's actually randomly generated smooth terrain instead of uh, adding smooth terrain to the previous block based map which didn't work too well. Oh my gosh, this random world generation is amazing. I haven't gotten around to seeing cities but you can see me in the video and the footage flying over just these new biomes, they look amazing. They did. They they worked so hard on this random world generation. I I imagine that would be incredibly hard to make. It generates random cities. I'm sure. Of, I mean, of course, they have to have like pre uh, pre made house options. Maybe. I mean, there's no way it generates that random houses. That would be insane. I'm not sure though. <laughs> I'm not sure, but I'm pretty sure. It, I mean, all cities would be different. They just have probably buildings that would be the same across different cities and I'm sure they have tons of different types of cities um, uh, wow this random world generation is amazing though I, it's gonna be so much fun it's gonna make this a whole new game for me I'm probably gonna sink a ton, ton more hours into this before alpha 10 or will it be beta 1 I don't know probably gonna be alpha 10 I don't know what they're doing I don't know how their update system works but they still have a lot more to add, of course. I mean, it's still alpha, but they, uh, and this this game's taking shape, guys. It's really, it really is. And so that's the main thing in this update. I really wanted to talk about. There's also, f there, I'm I'm never gonna be able to cover all of this update. It's insane. It's a massive update. Want to give you a general sense of what they've added, and, and of course, random world generation is the primary feature here. Um. Probably the second most noticeable feature would have to be the uh, the new GUI. The GUI looks awesome. It's like just it just looks nicer. So your food and stuff, your food bars, your health bars, your stamina bars, uh, just looks a lot better. I like the system they added. Um, the crafting menu and the inventory looks a lot better. It just looks cleaner. It's nice. The map's also different, so when you press M, you will, you will only see the area you visited, so that makes a lot of sense. Um, so if you have no idea what's out there, you got to go exploring. It's a lot of fun. So much. It's going to be so much fun. I only played for like half an hour just to test it out, get some footage, but oh, I have to tell you, I'm going to be playing this a lot. There's also some new buffs, like you can break your legs, sprain your legs, uh, you can drown. Because you can actually go underwater now, and there's an animation for going underwater, which is kind of that kind of annoyed me when they didn't have that. But it's good. So you can so you can swim, kind of. It's like you it's slightly swimming, a little bit. Uh, you can get concussions apparently. I don't know how you do that. That would, there's all there's remedies for all these things. It's gonna be a lot of fun. Uh, 
It's a nice, 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 nice. There's also cloth armor because there's additional cotton. They added cotton plants randomly spawning. Uh, they're like white and they're pretty cool. They're pretty cool guys. Uh, it just makes things look more pretty. Honestly, that's one of the reasons they added it. Then also, you can make cloth stuff, which is cool. There's so much. So much. There's, uh, on the map, there's also waypoints. And you can track your friends. You can also search recipes. <laughs> there's, uh, so this game is just coming along. They're adding all the features everybody wants. It's gonna, it's gonna be done sometime. <laughs> fairly soon. But, yeah, I'm just looking at this webpage right now. You can look at it it's gonna also link it because it shows all of the things they added all the things they changed bug fix bug fixes and everything there's so much stuff in here it's insane it's wrong <laughs> well i'm pretty sure i don't want to continue any farther because that's pretty much all i know i mean there's there's so much that i don't want to read all of this because it's just there's so much new stuff the main stuff the primary features though are gotta gotta be the random world generation the new gui the new buffs and debuffs guys this update's big though it's big it's this is gonna be revolutionary for the game i already see uh the player count in seven days that i had just like tripled today oh wow well thank you so much for watching this video kind of carried along a little bit it's a little bit long compared to some of my other update videos anyway thank you so much for watching i really appreciate it remember to smash that like button subscribe if you're new and uh i'll see you or I'll see you all later if you want to keep watching my videos if you don't that's fine i honestly don't care i'm sorry i haven't been posting lately but i'm gonna start posting some more school's almost back oh gosh well anyway been talking too long i will see you all guys later